a Northwestern University professor accused of inappropriate conduct is taking a leave of absence. A university spokesperson says Alec Klein requested the leave until the investigation is complete. And tonight, we're hearing from some of the women who made the accusations. Here's Eyewitness News reporter Leah Hope. Two local journalists become interview subjects. I was afraid, but I'm no longer afraid. Kaylin Belsha and Allison Flowers want their stories told and other women's stories heard about alleged abusive behavior by Northwestern professor Alec Klein. They were graduate students excited to be in Klein's class with this notable journalism career. Flowers also work with Klein. It's outrageous that he remains at Medill and it's time for him to go. Northwestern University alleges a new investigation after 10 women wrote a letter accusing Klein of being inappropriate with female students and staff. Some of the allegations included sexually suggestive conduct. They allege the university knew about complaints against Klein but didn't take action. This is someone that we've heard time and time and time again has had inappropriate conduct with students, either bullying, harassing them, or in some cases touching them inappropriately. Kaylin Belsha recalls an uncomfortable story she says Klein shared when only the two of them were alone in his office. He told me a story about how one time he really wanted to kiss this woman and he got up really close to me and started telling me about how he wanted to kiss this woman and instead he gave her a Hershey's kiss. And it was very uncomfortable because we were sitting right next to each other. Saying inappropriate stuff, mentioning his sex life to me asking me about my sex life. Olivia Paris says she quit working with Klein after repeated inappropriate and unwanted touching and talk. She says her sexual harassment complaint in 2015 did not affect change, but she hopes something changes now. What do I gain from making all these allegations up? I don't gain anything. I had the worst um, six months of my entire life working there. Northwestern University says they are investigating allegations made the past two days. No one responded to our request for an interview. But these women who wrote the letter say they have also heard from 14 more women with allegations against Klein. For now, he is on leave. And what really motivated these women to come forward, the Me Too movement, of course, but also they heard that there were students who were avoiding taking investigative journalism, and they want there to be future journalists. So this is what really prompted them to come forward.